Hello everyone, it's Mia back here today. We're gonna make another video, but this time it's not about gaming, it's about art. As you can see, I'm gonna compare some of my fanciest Faber Castell Artist Quality Watercolor Pencils by my chunky watercolor pencils. So, let's get started. As you can see, I draw a very big flower, and now I'm gonna show you how to draw a slightly smaller version. They're exactly the same way, so you can make them bigger. When drawing those paddles, you can just turn the page a little bit, and that's the trick to make it perfect. All right, we are almost there. Here we go. I'm gonna start coloring with the Faber-Castell color pencils, and they are super strong pigmented. They work super good, and for all those strong pigment on the paper, I just need to press really lightly, and they blend brilliant. So now, I'm just going to add a little bit of color to every single petal on the flower, and I hope I will get the effect I want it to. Let's blend it with some water. You can see it is getting from dark to light, and that is what I wanted. Yay! Alright. So I really love the beautiful petals. The color is also super nice and good. Okay, the Faber Castell flower is done. Now I'm going to work with my chunky pencils. But before that, I need to do a little bit of coloring test, which takes a bit of time. Please wait a bit. Now I am almost done. Just one more. Here we go. I have to press super hard to get those strong pigments. And look at the dot in the middle. It doesn't even blend. I'm going to do it the exact same way. And now they doesn't even work too. They're just horrible. So, as you can see, I have drawn two flowers in exactly the same way. The bigger one here is Faber-Castell, and the smaller one here is my Chunky Pencils. But, as you can see, the Faber-Castell one blends way better, and the color is so rich. But the Chunky one, I tried to find the most similar color in the Chunky Pencils to the Faber-Castell ones. And this one, I put in the center. It didn't even blend. It was just like... A dot there, and the flower is way smaller. You can see there's still white places, like this, like this. I color in them in the two same way. Since they're watercolors, I don't usually just color it fully, like normal pencils. And for the petals of this chunky flower, you can see it doesn't even blend. I apply very little amount of coloring in these but they blend so good and make a very nice sunflower. And this one just looks like very bad. So, Faber Castell wins! Yay! And well, I didn't say the chunky pencils are so bad, but you can still use them for normal pencil coloring. See, they work okay. And if you don't apply water to it, I think they works all right. They'll pass for any drawing. And thank you for watching. If you love it, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe. Bye!